at least into top six or into a top six qualifier. And look at that, we got two Pokemon on stage and then Rob and Terry here. Definitely free reign for revenge from Incineroar over here. A lot of projectiles to deal with to get that revenge charge up here. Also got Terry with the with the special attacks on the KOs. Yeah, with on the go. With the Mega and with that revenge mechanic, every Thunder Jolt, every laser that Rob wants to throw out, every gyro has to be calculated. Yeah, and gets the kickflip here. Nice right, crash it. That's that's the same crash. Able to down throw into the uh, Darkest Lariat as well. Not able to get in the Rising Upper there. And gets the Darkest Lariat once more. Oh, gets the parry, but not able to get back to stage. Is he going to make it? No. Not able to come back with Cross Chop. And that was just such well done work from Siege there. He started that with the Gyro in hand and another kill. This time, Nito going to be the one to bite the dust. Wow, what a call out from Miko there, just going with the Rob side beam. Oh, trying to get the down air power dunk, not able to connect there. Ooh, gotta watch out for that gyro as well. And what hit them? Not quite sure myself, but the Alolan whip is gonna be, is taken back to the stage, unable to shield every hit of the Darkest Lariat. Very fortunate for him too, if he tried to shield the last hit, that was definitely a shield break, but it gets him with the Alolan whip, and that is Rob's first stock. We're trying to land with down air there, but he does get Jab Jab Power Dunk. Miko letting go of the shield a little bit too early. Yeah, Jab Jab Power Dunk is going to be the ticket there, but the up smash right after to catch the neutral get up. All right, does get him with the back air here. Runs back to center stage, kicks the gyro out of... Oh, oh hits him with the dash attack on the left side of the stage, gets the rising upper once more. Rising tackle, but he's going to be poked right there with that aerial from Seed. Power Dunk, Power Dunk up high. Just mix him up. Grabs him in the wrong direction. All right, trying to go to four, uh, four tilt. Burn knuckle does hit both opponents there. Very nice. Just waiting for the come down there and gets him with the up smash. Miko just patrolling it with an air, but he's able to revenge it there. Mega uh -huh. has a little bit of power up and caught in that. Only got the sour spot, the beginning hitbox of the Alolan whip. All right, does go with Geyser there. Power Geyser not able to do, uh, not able to kill just yet. But gotta watch out, Pikachu is dead there. Also watch out for the four tilt buster, whoa. Down throw, is he gonna make it out? No, went for the no mash mix up, but the up smash from Miko is gonna be controlling that situation. What a recovery, very nice from Nito there, going with a crack shoot off the power gun. Gyro to interrupt that darkest lariat as well, the F tilt from Siege, and he fell out of the fair, text the side of the stage as well. Does make it back with Rising Tackle here. Got some Burst Wolf on deck. Down throw into the aerial. But the Arm Rotor actually going to be carrying Nito off the stage. All right. Trying to crack shit right through the gyro, but not going to work out for him. Not able to punish the Thunder as well. Just missing the forward smash in there. Pop once again in the Alolan Whip. Miko at 108. Rob is a very heavy character, so he is going to be able to live, but... 30 or 40 more percent, and it's gonna be the danger zone for him. All right, they're doing really well. Miko has Terry off stage with no jump. Power dunk, and power uh, rising tackle does make it with the extension charge. Rolls around, but doesn't complete the full jab. Mega is gonna get the kill with the F-Tilt. All right, they gotta play a little bit safe here, but forward tilt, gonna, wow. <laughs> no DI save you. Yeah, that was... I'm not sure he would have made it with the proper DI, but you're definitely not going to make it with that DI. There, there, no, like, that four tilt is a menace in itself. Mm -hmm. Like, he was mid-stage as well. Yeah. I don't think anything could have saved him at that point. And because of that slight step back, it covers a lot more distance than the original hit would indicate. Yeah. If you're at the ledge, it covers a neutral getup and roll, which is crazy. Yeah. It's in Aurora F tilt. Kind of not fair, but mm -hmm. he needs it. Yes. <laughs> like, like if he, ever he there was a character that could take it, I think I think it's Incineroar. Like Incineroar hits hard, sometimes unfairly hard, yeah. but he definitely needs it for for his status as a grappler. And Incineroar and Terry, among the two characters with the slowest ground speed in the entire game, catching multiple opponents with the jab jab power dunk. All y'all gonna get this. Looking like King of Fighters out here. <laughs> it's a one v three now. <laughs> Oh my god! Saved by the laser off of the Thunderbolt uh, 
spike there. Oh my god, he's still going off on the Pikachu offstage. Burning Knuckle is going to rob Pikachu of that first stock at about 80%. I believe that was the command input Burning Knuckle as well. Able to get out of the way, but I like that he just ran into it because even though that's the weakest hit, the final hit of the Darkest Lair as well, and just to get rid of the revenge before what could be a more devastating hit, yeah. it might be worth it. All right, he's finally got to go on deck, but gotta watch out there. Does get the four tilt Buster Wolf. Power guys are not gonna connect with anyone there, but that's very commanding space there. Up smash just out of the way, unable to SDI out of the jab jab power dunk. All right, watch out for the Alolan whip there. He's gonna hit his own team. What? He used his teammate to get to the rock? <laughs> Nino, you madman! Finally gonna make it back with the Skull Bash and armors through <laughs> with the beginning of that cross How? chop. Yo, Nino kind of has some smoothing right here. God, he's going around all this, but the rotor is finally gonna catch him there. Yeah, great awareness for Miko to just get the immediate punish, but Siege is down to his final stock at well. Mega and Nito both have two apiece. All right, gonna try. Not able to get him with Burning Knuckle roll read there. And very nice interruption from Mega on the combo on Nito. Yeah, Darkest Larry actually gonna separate the two of them. Ooh, and everybody's getting this work. Doesn't matter if you're Terry, doesn't matter if you're Pikachu, everybody's getting it. Yeah, Incineroar does not discriminate. Anyone can catch these hands. Yo, yeah, not, not not just the hands, he got the biceps. Look at <laughs> Yo, he's catching he's catching him with the full body. Please get him. Down tilt to the feet as well. Incineroar definitely hard carrying those.